Cause we've been driving so long I can't remember how we got here or how Sup guys, this is Exhaustion here and today I'm with my friend Garrett Yeah, yeah he's right there And today we're going to be playing a new series that I'm going to be making called Stellaris and we will be using the Galaxies at War Empire mod so yeah, basically, if you don't know this game, it's where you try to take over the world, and you have a huge navy. So, basically, this is my people. I've chose the empire. I'm humans. And we are humans. That's our name list. And then, we are natural engineers, slow learners, and intelligent. Our ruler is Emperor Palpatine, if you did not know. And... I guess, yeah. And we live on continental worlds. Our name is, our world is Coastmont. This is our city. And we are militarists, xenophobes, and this means that basically we don't like anybody else in the whole galaxy. And then militarists, and our civics is the Imperial Navy, which means we get like better Navy than everyone else. And inefficient an efficient blue KSC, which means we get more systems. And then, uh, authority is the Imperial Ruling Council. Our name's the Galactic Empire. This is our flag right here. We use energy weapons, and the whole galaxy will be using hyperspace. And we are using Empire light ships. So, yeah. Um, I'll leave the mod list down in the description if you guys want to play by yourself. So, yeah, let's save this and click done. Okay. So, I'm ready. And the gate's ready. So, let's go. And I, I really like this new loading screens because the normal game, like, it gets boring after a while. Because it also has, like, tips and just quotes. A new one. So here we are, and basically we are syncing up right now because it is multiplayer. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, so the Galactic Empire. In the eon since the first primitive human communities took shape in the meadows and forests and forests of coasts, our civilization has spread and prospered. Now, after the discovery of Hyperlane Network, the finest minds of the Galactic Empire have finished development of the first hyperdrives. The stars themselves are finally within our glass. So, basically, this is our empire. This is Gothon. And we need to pick up some research. So, we're gonna go with solar powers. Um, probably biolab. What do you want the speed set to? Uh, just do normal first. So, this is our ships. Pretty cool. That's our space station. And at the space station, you can build new ships, I'll call it. And if you're new to this game, F10 is the hotkey for your ship designer. And once we, like, get, like, New assembly yards will be able to build better ships. So this is our first ship, the Guardian. As you can see. So what we need to do is we need to our science ship and survey the system. And once he finds something, Chancellor Ria Cafe is the new hair upon our empire and will take the throne when our current ruler dies. So guys, how I'm gonna do this series is if you want if you're a subscriber, you can comment down below what you want like to be named and I can make you like a captain of a ship for instance. Like this is this, but if you wanna be in posting on you know, big fleet. Then, yeah, we can just assign people. 
Like if someone wants to be a scientist, just say your name and say what your name wants to be and what ship you want. So yeah. And I'll name you. So this is the galaxy. We are right here, which is good. Okay, and basically what we're going to do right now is I'm going to build us another science ship. I just turned that down. Okay, thank you. And with this new science ship, what we're going to do is we will be surveying this world, these the ones with the green ones means that we could possibly live on them. So yeah. And then this is our surface of course on. So what we will be doing is Building a farm for those people. As you can see, we have a good amount of food. But our minerals we don't have a lot of. Our science ship will be done in 10 days. And as you can see, it's 2,200, the 5th month and the 25th day. So, yeah, that's... Yeah. And we've got our science ship now. And we're going to assign a new scientist. We're going to go with... This. So if you want to be the scientist, then just comment down below what name you want and I can name that person after you. <laughs> so the whole galaxy is going to be using hyperspace lanes. So, yeah, where do you compare to the Sanjanus Expanse? The Sanjanus Expanse? Yeah. I am up and to the right of it. Okay, good. That's what I am too. So, we'll buy close to each other. They should be, like, really close. I haven't set the cluster players. Oh. And, guys, he's also the Empire. Oh, but as you can see, we have some power coming in, so let's go build some power plants. This gas giant is producing power. Oops. <laughs> I did not mean to do that, I'm sorry guys. So let's see what... Has he found anything yet? Here's a potential new world. And I'm going to actually send out a task force to this planet. Okay, so our task force is now going there, which is good. 
And guys, like the video if you enjoyed this series or if you want to see more of it. This is going to be more of a peaceful strategic series. <coughs> oh, I just realized that's really cool. They have their um, ranks, not the stars. So a scientist is like, I want to guess a lieutenant. So, uh, first, our plant has finally been completely scanned, and we have two power, two minerals, and two bio. So, if you want the speed sped up to site. Yeah, yeah. Can you turn up the speed? Okay. The fast or fast is? Just fast. Okay. As you can see, our construction ship is not really almost done. But he's walking around. No military feet got there, and we're discovering new names of planets, so let's now send them um, right there. We finished a farm, which is good, which is good. And currently, since we have no new technology, oh, we could go new That's above the chambers. Okay. The ISS Ocean has made a startling find in Eusicapus 3. The planet is teemly with alien life. For the first time in history, we have encountered life forms. We've encountered life forms that did not originate on Coruscant. This amazing discovery has silenced those who believe we are alone in the universe. Although no one, none of the alien creatures found on Eucapas 3 are sentient, or like, it is likely only a matter of time before we encounter beings that are. And we got society research. So that's great. That's cool. Simple forms of life. The galactic empire is abuzz with news that alien organisms discovered by the ISS ocean some time ago. For, while far from intelligent, there is life out there in an incapable reality and deeply unsettling prospect. Let's get some stormtroopers training. No, not right now. We don't need them right now. There's only one buying it. Let's get our construction ship to start building minerals now. And this is our refinery. I'll take ban of gas in the finery if you get that reference from Bespin.
Let's send them to them. And then we'll wrap them back around. Okay, let's sign ship. So what our military fleet is doing, it's just going around. It's not actually, like, surveying the worlds. It's just, you know, like, it's kind of like finding out new worlds. It's not actually surveying them. So our galactic empire is black, and then the stuff we found is a brown. Our construction ship is very busy, I see. We still need 14 months to even unlock anything. Um, the head of the Empire's Physics Research Department has gone missing, along with the privately funded, highly experimental prototype science ship, also known as TIE Fighter. Huh, that's interesting. So get, get science. One of the head scientists has disappeared along with the prototype TIE Fighter. Now, we can't build research stations because we don't have the money. See? <coughs> Sorry, I got myself sick a little bit. So, see, we are gaining 9 minerals per month and 3 energy. We now know without doubt that living thriving biosphere is not something unique to Coruscant. Both the scientific community and the public at large are equal to learn more about various forms of alien life found throughout the galaxy. Efforts to, to catalog life forms and counter are already underway, but our xenobiologists have urged us to focus on a planetary survey. Efforts have rolled. Life bearing words. Let's start that. Some kind of unknown structure is sliding. They appeal to be using astro static lift to remain point. Yeah, so let's research that. Good luck, my friend. Okay, let's build research stations. Let's bring our military fleet around. We have encountered some from alien vessels and the Santa Paul These strange objects have been flagged of alphabets. Do we can learn about them? I'm gonna say that's me and you because I got the same. A small uh, aerostat colony was found floating just above the atmosphere of Standard 3. It appears to, be, to have been self sufficient and remains from several different species were found on board. At best, we can tell the colony was some kind of social experience conducted centuries ago that ultimately ended with the, with the colonists massacring each other. 
We've downloaded all of the data found in the colony's limited database. That's good. Because we got research. So, we might have actually found Gia by now. Let's research Alpha Menaces. <coughs> so, it will be done in five months. But this has put a stop to uh, society research. We are receiving a weak signal from the surface of this planet. The surface appears to be some kind of dragon creature. Let's research it. And then I want you to research this one. Okay, our construction ship is finally done. But we don't have enough minerals to build anything else, so I'm just gonna go tell them to dock up. These will save us power. Okay, I paused it. The models in this game is really nice. Okay, you can unpause it now again. I didn't know it was paused. Well, I told you. Look what our task was. I found my scientist and they left some probes to attack me. I think it's like a black hole. Now just to see whether my ships will win or they The ISS Ocean Master weakening signal I was coming from the Bishrama foe. And despite the best of efforts, the scientists. Ah, oh, they failed. <laughs> hey, I found Gosa. I found Gid. I found Gid so far. <laughs> The Empire. We do not care for you for this. Nice that we have encountered intelligent alien life for the first time has shaken our society to the core. Leaked footage of these bizarre creatures is spreading through media outlets across the galactic empire. Many civilian citizens have been gripped by panic, laughing, have been reported. In several cities of course, are the strange ear zones appear to have achieved a level of technology similar to our own, but they are clearly space flying, while they are regarded as species of fear, hatred, cold, indifference, and all that But guys, basically, that doesn't matter because we will be in a federation. See? Eventually. Yeah. Because I think Garrett will be. Picking the Federation tree, and I'm going to be picking probably the Supreme Mystery tree. <coughs> so, maybe I'm. Oh, wow. My two So maybe by like episode two or three, we'll be in a federation, hopefully. Ooh, this system has a good amount. And guys, I, I'll border just grew a lot because I picked up supremacy, which makes it a border range grow by twenty percent. That's good. Yeah, what did you pick up? Good. What one did you pick up? Like, Unity. What do you mean, pick up? Did you get Supreme Free Diplomacy? Discovery? Oh, I, I did, um... I completely just forgot. I did Domination. 
Mm. Okay. This asteroid was evidently used as a junkyard by someone at some point in the distant past. The man all manner of discarded machinery and metallic refuse has been deposited inside the asteroid's weak gravity well, but slowly pulled into the jumble of debris that now covers the surface. There is nothing particular about to be found there, but a lot of metal could be salvaged by a mining station. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna send out my construction ship to here, and I wanna build my station soon. We encountered some fallen alien vessels in the Glasshound system, these strange objects. These strange objects have been flagged as being a menace until we can learn more about them. We should proceed with caution. Yeah, we got that. Okay. We have recovered artifacts from an ancient alien civilization, level 328. From what? We translated so far of their language. We have learned that these aliens called themselves Irasian Condand. They were interstellar power and held sway over the region of the galaxy a little over a million years ago. They appear to have been six limbed mammalians, and there are several references of some sort of play called. Javelin parks, which swept across the Empire, devastating results, possibly leading to their extinction. <coughs> and we could have, go. Have you met anyone else? Um, no. I just met someone. Uh, a gamma I... menace. Oh, yeah, I've met beta menaces. I'm gonna go here for me, because that will be useful later on, because as you can see, they're desert. Gantz Empire likes the desert. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tear from deserts into continentals so that I can live on them, or like other snow places or whatever. Like, it just helps. Okay. I have two gold pieces. Okay. Oh, I have four. Including the one I'm living on. <coughs> we have detected the presence of a free space alien civilization on GAC and Moon system. Asmineric containers and light pollution visible from orbit are consistent with a distantly populated machine age society. They appear to have mastered air travel. And factories. Mass producing goods in their cities. We should consider building an observation post above their world. Stay them more closely. So, basically, what this is, guys, is there's a planet in a um, range, like in a galaxy, that is in the industrial age. Or, like, the modern age. Our age, kind of. Where they have planes and all that. Which is kind of really cool. So, see, we need. Cover assembly yards, which I'm gonna go for. <coughs> so, yeah. I finished researching on solar panels. Oh, that's good. Oh. My offer. I did, I did not see that. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. Okay, so... What? I'm gonna go into the system. I'm gonna build a mining station. Yes, look at that. Four minerals. This 
engineering that would be good. So what we could do is we could like purge this civilization. Comment down below if you want that. To where we attack industrial um let's look what they look like. <laughs> So basically, this the pets. <laughs> Ooh, and Batharian stone, whatever that is. Ooh, that's really good. It's like a power plant. A little power plant? No, it's better than power, power plants. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is that military fleet? Here we are. Well, guys, um, I guess this about includes our first episode of Stellaris, so thank you guys for watching, like, and subscribe, and comment if you want to see more of this. Bye!